Yes, welcome everybody to Forever Motorsports here. We've just finished uh, Singapore qualifying and uh, massive, massive, massive news of nowadays. the day. Wow, <laughs> absolute chaos from start to finish. Tell us though, the biggest news from that session there, Mark. Red Bull did not make it out of Q2. Verstappen finished 11th, Perez in 13th. He needed to get a good lap in Verstappen right at the end of Q2, left it right late, made a big mess up in Sector 1 and as a result, didn't make it past. So Perez and Verstappen are going to be starting in one of the most difficult Grand Prix to overtake all the way down in 11th and 13th respectively. Though, notably, Ferrari starts on pole with Carlos Sainz up there, Russell just behind him in second and Leclerc third, Norris in fourth, Hamilton fifth, Magnussen sixth, Alonso in seventh, Ocon in eighth, Hulkenberg in ninth and Lawson in tenth. Then, of course, with the major upset, Max Verstappen in 11th, uh, Pierre Gasly 12th, Sergio Perez down in 13th, Albon 14th, Snowden 15th, Bottas 16th, Piastri then down in 17th. He unfortunately got caught out by the crash of Lance Stroll, who is down in 20th, Sargent 18th, Stroll 19th, um, Joe 19th, and Stroll, of course, having a major shunt at the end of Q1. He, he binned it into the wall with a major oversteer through turn 19. Hit into the Tech Pro barriers on the start finish straight, caused a massive delay with the red flag, and unfortunately caught out the likes of Piastri with him being eliminated. Those Red Bulls though, are going to have a very difficult day tomorrow in the race. They're going to have a lot of fighting to do. Yeah, that's exactly that. I think the Red Bulls are really going to struggle tomorrow. It's a very difficult track to overtake. Of course, there's a change in the final chicane. Of course, the third sector's lost that uh, those few extra turns. So there's another long straight which means it might be able to be uh, easier for cars to follow and overtake, but it's going to be difficult tomorrow, I think. And Red Bull starting so far down tomorrow, they cannot be favourites. And also race pace throughout the entire weekend has said that they're not that much quicker, if they even are quicker, than the other teams. Uh, um, Fernando Alonso and, Alon and uh, Aston Martin's been looking quick for race pace. Those Ferraris have been looking very quick for race pace. Red Bull's not as quick. So, and of course, yeah. there's that outlier of the Haas up in sixth place. What can they do through the race? I think they've also shown some all right race pace. Not incredible, but it's not been horrific. So no. we could have a lot of different contenders for this race uh, tomorrow on Sunday. Yeah, and I think, unfortunately, it's actually going to come straight down to uh, Ferrari and Mercedes. Which one's going to have the better... Well, I know which one's going to have the better strategy. But who's going to have the better race tomorrow, of course, between Sainz, Russell, Leclerc, uh, Hamilton, and, of course, that outline McLaren, of, of course, of Norris, his teammate, unfortunately, getting caught out, as we said. So it's going to be such an interesting race tomorrow in terms of who can finish first. And it's going to be very difficult for George Russell splitting those two Ferraris. They have the upper hand in terms of strategy, if they get it right, that is. But it's going to be very difficult for them. Yeah, it's exactly that. It's going to be very, very difficult. So thank you guys so much. For tuning in, of course, we're going to be bringing you the race tomorrow live for you on Forever Motorsports here with myself, Mark, and Reese alongside me. Um, please be sure to like this video and uh, please be sure to subscribe to the channel as well. We're going to get to 2,000 subscribers as quickly as we possibly can. And uh, yeah, Reese, any final comments? Well, just a very, very exciting end to qualifying here today in Singapore. Please, please be sure to join us tomorrow for the Singapore Grand Prix here on Forever Motorsports. Uh, we've been... I've been Reese. Mark's been Mark. Thank you very much, though, for joining us today. Uh, yeah, we certainly hope to see you tomorrow in the race in Singapore. Cheerio.